What's bracking you through Apollo's over here? And today we were like, bro, Pepper Le Pew got canceled. He's not going to be in the next Space Jam movie. You might be asking why. Because the new director, this broad, says his... <clears throat> what's the word? What's the word I want to use? Um, His behavior is unacceptable. Yes, this cartoon character from who knows how many years ago, his behavior is un in unacceptable. She thinks he's going to be a bad influence for the next generation of children. Like, shut the fuck up. He is a cartoon character. He is a cartoon character, my guy. Stop it. I remember watching Pepe Le Pew back in the kid, and did I grow up to be anything like him? Hell no. And let me give you a brief history of Pepe Le Pew. His old shtick, because every Looney Tune character had a shtick. His old shtick was, A, there would always be this cat, and she would get painted, right? She would, she would like, get the skunk painted like a stripe would go down her back and Pepe would think she was a fellow skunk and try to like holler at her you know try to like get her to love him and shit like that and the cat would always reject him and Pepe would not know that no means no and he would like you know just continue to harass her or whatever and it, it was fun it was funny and it was funny like he would constantly get his ass whooped but he would like never give up on her and I'm pretty sure by the end of the series she would fall in love with him because she would appreciate that hey this dude's doing all this for me the least I can do is, a hey, say, hey, like, you, you want to go out? Like, you, you've gone through all this trouble. Do you want to go out? So, that, like, that's the brief history of Pepe Le Pew. If you want to know, like, if you want to know, like, the brief history better, like, I, I would suggest going to watch some of his cartoons. It could probably explain it a lot better than I can. But, hey, apparently this broad, the new director of this new Space Jam movie, is like, yeah, Pepe Le Pew, you're being counted, my guy. You're, you're bad for kids nowadays. Kids nowadays don't know the difference between no and yes. And let me tell you something. I know the difference between no and fucking yes. Let me, let me tell you this little story. There was one time. It was me chilling with this dom, right? I was at her house. And I asked her, like, bold facely, hey, you want to fuck? She was like, nah. She said, nah. And you know, you know, you want to know what I did? I turned around. I turned around and started playing on my fucking Nintendo Switch because I bought the Nintendo Switch over. And you know what? You want to know what the broad said to me? She said, mm mm. You give up too easily. And I'm like, well, yeah. Do you not know what era we're living in? No means no. I know that no means no. I ain't about to get canceled for your dumb ass. So, yeah. Pepe, I grew up watching Pepe Le Pew, And I grew up to be nothing like Pepe Le Pew. That's what I'm trying to say. Anyways, peace and love. Apollo 7. I'm out.